Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. On 25th November 2021, the fourth of six Calvary class submarine called INS Vela was commissioned into Indian Navy. The other three submarines of this class which are already in service are INS Calvary, INS Khanderi and INS Karanj. On 1st February 2022, the fifth submarine of this class called Vagir has commenced her sea trials. The submarine was launched on November 12th last year from the weight basin of Majgaon Dock Shipyards Limited. The induction of Vagir is also planned in this year. The last submarine of this class, Vakshir, was in last stage of construction and can be launched soon but there is no official confirmation about it. This vessel is said to be commissioned into Indian Navy by the end of 2022 or early 2023. The Calvary class is a class of diesel attack submarine based on the Scorpion class submarine. Under the Project 25, 6 Calvary class submarine is to be built for $3.23 billion. The submarine has been designed and developed by French Defence Major Naval Group, former DCNS and Spanish state-owned entity Navantia. It is being licensed built at MDL. They are the most advanced and the newest submarine in the fleet of Indian Navy. These are hunter-killer submarines meaning designed to attack and sink the adversary vessels. Beside anti-ship and anti-submarine role, the submarine can also be used for laying mines, intelligence gathering and surveillance. The Calvary class submarine has a displacement of 1,615 tons when surfaced and 1,775 tons when submerged. It can reach a top speed of 37 km per hour when submerged and maximum speed of 20 km per hour when surfaced. The submarine has a range of 12,000 km at 15,000 km per hour when surfaced. The hull Fin and hydroplanes are designed for minimum underwater resistance and all equipment inside the pressure hull is mounted on shock absorbing cradles for enhanced stealth. The submarine is equipped with 6 533 mm torpedo tubes for a combination of 8 heavyweight wire guided German made surface and underwater target SUT torpedoes and SM 39 Exocet anti ship missiles by MBDA or 30 mines in place of both. The class is also fitted with mobile C-303S anti-torpedo decoys for self-defense. The weapon system and sensors are integrated with submarine tactical integrated combat system SUPTIX. It has a sonar system which is capable of low frequency analysis and reaching low far enabling long range detection and classification. The submarine's attack and search periscopes are equipped with infrared low light level cameras and laser range finders. These submarines have highly advanced combat management system and a sophisticated integrated platform management system. There are plans to integrate DRDO's AIP system with the submarine during the refit program planned to commence from 2023 onwards. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and jai hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We'll be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.